Hi, Jefferson Santos here, seven-figure entrepreneur and author of the book, Higher Life Design. And today we're gonna to talk about why people fail. And I don't like that word fail, but you know what's good about failing? Is you're learning what not to do, right? You know, we always, we always hear about failing your way to success. Well, there's four things that we do to really cause our failure. And the first thing that we do is we have self-doubt. We literally doubt that we can even do it in our competency. And so we don't even get out of the gates. We don't even get started. You know, there's, a, there's an old Chinese proverb that talks about the journey of a thousand miles starts with the first step. But you have to take the first step. And that self-doubt thing starts going around in your head and you're listening to those tapes and that's not going to serve you. So if you want to prevent failure, you got to at least start inching your way forward because inch by inch, it's a, it's a cinch, right? All right, number two is distraction. I mean, the key thing with distraction is it's distraction is impeding you from your progress. Focus equals winning. Focus equals winning. And so you have to be consistent and persistent enough to actually get the job done. And so you gotta pay attention. You can't be distracted. There's so many crazy things out there. We got Facebook, Twitter, Snapchat, Instagram, a billion other things out there to take our attention away from the task at hand and we're trying to be successful at. And so once again, to ensure your failure, get distracted. And, and, and it's really important that you're aware that you're being distracted because if you're aware of it, you can direct your mind to the task at hand and get off you know, whatever you're, I guess, distracted by and get back on track. That's really, really important. So, so far we've talked about self-doubt and distraction. Okay, the third thing is ignorance. Not knowing what to do or not even knowing the solution or having to find the solution. Once again, part of this is competency. You know, this we, I talked about the, the competency confidence curve. As we get more confidence, we get more competence. And if we get more competence, we get more confidence and it gets bigger, better and better and better and better. And so it's important that you you, you, you know what you need to do. And, and that part of that's just being a good student. I mean, I'm a student every single day. You know, when you, when you feel like you've known, when you feel like you know everything, that's kind of like the beginning of the end, right? You know, you, I've probably heard the term, if you're green, you're growing. If you're ripe, you're rotten. You probably heard that before. Nobody wants to be rotten, right? We want to keep on learning. And so it's, it's important that we don't let that ignorance creep in just because we don't know. It's important to know. It's important to, to have mastery of what we're trying to do. And the fourth thing is ineptitude, or the word inept, that's kind of a big word, right? Basically that means you know what to do, but you don't do it. And you don't do it long enough and consistent enough. I mean, how bad is that? You know exactly what you're supposed to do, but you don't do it. Part of that is a personal growth issue, okay? Is you know what to do, you know? You know you gotta pick up the phone, you know you gotta make calls, or you gotta do your work, or you do your tasks, or whatever, but you don't do it. You know you're supposed to honor your spouse and, and, and honor people, but you don't do it. Or if you don't do it, you don't do it long enough and consistent enough. Once again, that's a part of failure. And so knowing these four things is important because if you know them, you're aware of them, and then you don't do them. You do the opposite of them, right? We talked about self-doubt, we talked about distraction, we talked about ignorance, and we talked about ineptitude. Not, you know what to do, but you don't do it. Those are the four sure things that are gonna help you fail at whatever you do. So what do we do? We do the opposite. And I think awareness is very key of these four things. So. With that said, let's aim to our success. Let's shoot for the moon. And my hope, my wish for you is to help you arrive at your intended destination, healthy, wealthy, and happy.